Hi Aries, welcome to your reading. This is for your April 16th and 17th of 2020. This is for Aries Ascendant, Moon Rising and Venus Placement on their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross Watchers are always welcome. Cross Watchers, if I described someone and you know that it is not you, it is not you, okay? I don't know you personally, so I don't have means or intention of attacking someone, all right? You know yourself better. If I describe someone and it's a total opposite of your personali personality, don't lose yourself, all right? Besides, this is not a personal reading. Don't fit yourself into that character. <clears throat> Aries, this is for... If you resonate with this, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, then come back here after... Come back to this reading after a week or two. Time is fluid. If you resonate with some bits and pieces, congratulations as well. For I am doing a collective reading to those new people in this um, channel, in this video, consider subscribing. I always host a party online where you can ask a questions free of charge let's do the reading Aries a fresh start a new beginning how redundant right a fresh and this is how redundant it is a fresh new start something big all right something big something passionate it could be a project it could be a person something that you wanted to start i'm not i'm not sure if this is something that you want to start alone because okay universe called for your judgment and you left someone here or it's here it's either you left someone or you came from a not so good um situation wherein you are going to a calmer water you might be connecting with a capricorn or um libra here or has a libra or capricorn placement on their chart or you have these placements on your chart something that is not working for you anymore that you left i want to clarify that what this is about hmm. that's the reason You are giving yourself to someone and someone do not appreciate your cup. That's why even though you have love for them, you turn your back on this connection. And this is a brand new start, a passionate one. You went to a calmer water. Now they want to come back. They want to come back. But I cannot see resistance. But I can see it's either confusion or doubt. It's either con confusion or doubt that they want to come back. But there's a plan. All right. There's already a plan. Um, it already went to their head that they want to come back. But doing it in action 
That's the reason why you cut this connection now. It's here. I'm not sure why Libra is very prominent and now you might be connecting with a Scorpio or has a Scorpio placement on their chart or you have a Scorpio placement on your chart. <sighs> Whoever this is who's hanging in a limbo and I think this is not you, um, Aries, because they're not enlightened yet. Okay, they're not they're not even struggling they're not even struggling they're not even missing you I'm sorry for the word um, it, it feels like there's no struggle for them even though the world I feel that they don't care at all it's here they want to come back but that's the reason they, they want to come back but they're not making any steps because they don't really care at all. Probably they just missed someone. One one one. I am seeing number one one one. Let me see here. One one one. Again, I am not a numerologist, so check that synchronicity. What that is. Um, Ace of Cups. It could be you drinking your own cup, self love. Or someone will give you some I mean their cup I think this is you who worked hard on the relationship that didn't work and here drinking your own cup and there's nothing wrong with that wanna <sighs> they want to come back but there are people who is you know that that could be their confusion is they are more listening to other people how strange another five and mm, another hangman here and now from this hangman you will see the difference right to this hangman see the difference they will have an enlightenment but that will be in the future they feel they will and this is also an enlightenment with the um either decision or voices of others because of this other person of other advices or other um, people who made this connection you know not come to flourishing they're gonna have a an enlightenment here I'm not sure if they're gonna listen to them or if there's someone who's gonna, gonna give them an advice a good advice or the advices will not work or leave them leave these people behind but there is like what I mentioned, there is a plan of going back. There is. A fiery climax, a fiery climax approaches, and this is you. See Aries? A fiery climax approaches full moon in Aries so a higher chance of reconciliation but it will take time it will take time so this is your reading um, Aries if you want to go in depth you can book a personal reading with me if you resonate with this click the subscribe button don't forget to smash that notification bell um, you might be a subscriber but you're not gonna see the video because there's a change in YouTube algorithm so thank you again for watching um, for those new please click the subscribe button
smash the notification bell leave a comment whatever it is if this resonates with you okay i'm very interactive thank you for watching love and light to you namaste goodbye aries